what's up guys welcome back to my channel oh welcome if you are new my name is Rafika I'm out of breath I'm out of breath I'm not even gonna lie so I just did like a little grocery run I went to Kroger's and did like an online grocery pickup which I must say wasn't that bad my head was starting to bother me really bad earlier and I took a nap and when I woke up, I felt better. So that's good. And let me know the medicine is trying to work. You know what I'm saying? My mom drove two and a half hours to come get me. Then an hour to my appointment. An hour back to bring me home. Two and a half hours back home. When I tell you I love my mommy. I mean, I loved my mommy before. I love my mommy. Like, she has been such a help. I just want to cry like oh my gosh i just want to cry i just want to cry because as soon as i went to my eye doctor and she was like go to the er immediately after you leave my office and i went my mom came i got all the kids from school took them home because i know a little 16 so she was there with the little girls and i'm glad that a little 16 and i didn't want that on her just home with the, the little girls my husband was going out of town for work but when I tell y'all, I called my mom and she was like on the road immediately after that. She got to my kids. I picked them up, took them home probably by, by 11. My mama was to my kids by like three o'clock, baby. Did not waste no time or play. Spend the night with them. Took them back with her. I'm just so glad for my mom. So I did a grocery order for the kids for school because I'm just still healing, y'all. This is a lot. It don't, I see no, a lot of people don't really talk about this type of... I don't know if it's disease or what it is. I'm, I'm still learning about it myself. But I just want to show y'all what I got from Kroger's. I did an online grocery pickup. I just went. They put it in my trunk. And um, I lost six pounds when I went to the doctor. So... The kind of thing I got, since I don't have any underlying diseases, it could come from having a whole lot of stuff. And they ruled out diseases and kidney failure, um, liver failure. My liver is really good. My kidneys are really good. I don't have HIV, syphilis. I don't have um, any of that stuff. Um, but my doctor did pick up on my hemoglobin was 10, a 10. She said my good cholesterol is supposed to be over 50. It's a 39. My bad cholesterol is supposed to be a hundred. It's 129. So she do got me on a diet, but she said it could come from being overweight. And it could also come from having sleep apnea. And I probably do got sleep apnea because I was supposed to do a study for that. But I never got around to doing it because my husband did say when I sleep at night, I snore. And he was like, sometimes, some days are better than others. Some days I snore really loud. And um, and what amplifies what I have is stress and insomnia. So, and I have been stressed and not sleeping for like three weeks. So I think I talked about that in the vlog, how I'm not getting any sleep. And I've been stressed, so that just amplified what I have. So I just been trying to relax and woosie myself and stuff like that but it will get better but i do need to lose weight i lost six pounds y'all i'm so proud of that i'm gonna keep that up because i want to continue to lose weight i just got to remember to drink because the medicine i'm on it made me not have an appetite i don't want to eat it had me not want to eat anything so i had this rotisserie chicken that i brought like the day before yesterday that i never cooked because my husband had ended up buying pizza but I got this rotisserie chicken. It's done, y'all. It probably don't look done. It kind of look white underneath there. And it like it's half-cooked chicken. I mean, not cooked chicken. But it's a rotisserie chicken. And I just ate that without the skin. I just ate the meat part. And um, I just had a wing. A bird, no, a leg. I had a leg. And I ate that like at 11. And that was the only thing I ate all day. What's wrong, Ava? Ooh, 
She's not winning fair and square. Yeah. Tell her to stop cheating right now. That's not fair. Yeah, tell her to stop that. She's cheating. Oh my gosh. That's one thing. Don't stop being a parent. Y'all gotta stop cheating. Play the, play the game fair and square. Capiche? You're not playing fair and square, and she's she's definitely not lying, Shada. You you cheat to win, and I know you do. Okay, stop. Just play nice. Okay, let me show y'all. So I got tilapia because I think I'm gonna bake some of this and put me some up. I got some eggos for the kids, some chips. I got eggs bread and y'all know i don't even eat eggs but i got me some for the protein and i got me some honey nut granola i also got these honey grams i don't know i like honey grams of course i'm not going to be eating a lot of those i got these for the kids some teddy grams I also got this for the kids. These all for their snacks for school. And then I got meat. Y'all know I try not to get them a bunch of processed meat. My daughter told me to lay off processed food and um, processed meat and no fried foods and no going out to eat. So I'm not doing any of that stuff. I also got me some Greek yogurt. I also got me this Nusa. Yogurt, this is so good to me. I love this. I probably should have got two of these, but I could always order me another one another time. Yeah, I know. I had to get the kids some water for school because they absolutely love this water. And then I got me this mayo with olive oil. I'm going to see how this tastes. Um, I don't know how that's going to taste. And then we got this mayo for the kids. Got me another coconut water to drink sometime. Got my husband a coconut water. Had to get the kids some apples and myself because, of course, I need apples. I also got myself some fish. Because I heard that this was really good when it comes to um, protein and low on sodium. So I got me some salmon. I also got some hash browns. I don't know if this would be like good in pro. I mean, um, sodium probably not. Cause this actually say this is. I don't know. It says season. I didn't want season. Um, and then I got some Cheerios. So yeah, <sighs> this is what I got the kids to add to their lunch. Believe it or not, this little bit of stuff was like one eighteen for this little grocery pickup order here. She also told me to drink non-fat milk and eat very small portions of food. And we're gonna add lots of fruits and vegetables in my diet. I also got a lot of peppers and onions um, that I have. I have um, green bell peppers, orange, red, yellow onions. Um, I heard that cooked onions works better with my condition than um, raw onions so i'm not eating raw onions for a while i um, definitely not eating any snacks not eating any fried foods not eating any um processed food well, i guess the potatoes would be considered processed because this is already done but i mean the fish is it processed fish because it's already packaged 
I don't know. We just going to take it a step at a time, y'all. We just going to get better at what I'm eating, smaller portions, and not eating, going not to eat, basically. She told me not to go out to eat, not to eat out, and not to put um, a lot of seasoning on my food. Um, I was supposed to have Mrs. Dash seasoning, but I don't think I ordered that. Yeah, or did I? I think I'm supposed to have Mrs. Dash. Oh, hold on. All right, y'all. So I've been laying on the couch <laughs> because I actually started feeling um, nauseated. But that's a side effect. You feel nauseated. Um, and I was just feeling a little nauseated. I was laying down in the room for a little while, but I actually got chicken cooking in the oven. I want to do um, broccoli or um, screen beans. The only thing with this, I just hate that um, I have to cook food separately with this process. That's the only thing, but the chicken looks good. I got the chicken in the bacon dish, but I wrapped mine separately in aluminum foil and I seasoned it with um, Mrs. Dash without salt. So basically like it got no seasoning <laughs> on it. But I also took out me this steak, which I probably put in the refrigerator because I was going to meal prep with that and make me lunch and have my husband something for him to take to work through the week and i still might do that i got my avocado i almost forgot about that i can eat me some avocado in the morning some avocado toast and eggs i cook one toast <laughs> and one egg with some avocado i could do that to have something in my tummy but um, I probably cook that steak later. That way I could meal prep from some lunch as well. But um, I decided to do yellow rice because I don't have any white rice. I was just mad, disappointed about that. But this is my first time cooking my little bacon dish, and it smells so good. I'm about to. Dang, I just realized my cart was broke. So this is the chicken. I'm gonna let it cook for a little while longer. Mine's is in the um, foil. See, none of the water is getting inside my container. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna let it cook for a little while longer. Put the lid back on. Look good though. Y'all look at what one of my kids did. <laughs> Wait, what? Shot him. All right, y'all, so we got yellow rice because we have white rice and then this is the chicken oh it looks so good my little chicken still in the little aluminum foil right now but we about to eat hey no y'all i did not cook no vegetables normally i would but when I tell y'all it took a lot of strength for me to cook this, my kid, they eating. At least they eating. They getting their veggies off of these peppers and onions. But I just couldn't. I did what I can do. We we working together, me and my family as a team right now with this. Because if y'all just do Google or uh, go on TikTok, if y'all interested, and knowing a little bit more about intracranial hypertension, all the videos and everything will pop up and it will give y'all all the knowledge and everything you all need to see what I'm dealing with. Y'all would know. But anyway, I'm about to go ahead and close out today's video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe to your channel. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.